Virgo, it's Nicola. So let's see what messages we have for the week of December the 1st through the 8th. What messages do we have for Virgo? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. December the 1st ooh, through the 8th of 2018. Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. December the 1st through the 8th of 2018. Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. December the 1st. The Let's see what we got. Underline energy, let go of control issues. You may need to let go of some things and allow it to and allow the situation to unfold naturally. Especially if you're in a relationship and you're trying to control how something comes out, you need to let go. Some of you guys are dealing with past life situations, exes, um, trying to figure out if it's safe for you to love. There's a separation and a retreat that is happening. Um, there may not be enough attraction or chemistry within you and a true love entity or someone may be separating and retreating going to our true love. But there may not, might, there may not be an attraction. Um, words won't come out. There may not be enough attraction or chemistry to keep a situation moving. Someone may feel like there's not. You may feel like there's not enough attraction to keep something moving. But someone may be trying to retreat from a situation and go toward true love. So we got past life situations, past life relationship here. Why is past life relationship here? Why is past life relationship here? It says you've known each other before. Past life relationship. It's too many. Secrets. This could be in the ethers. This could be a soulmate moving forward. If this is not a soulmate, this for a lot of you guys, this is a soulmate. But if not, there's a lot of um, illusions around the situation, a lot of secrets around the situation. That's why you feel like you don't know if it's if you're safe to open yourself up to this. So there's a lot of anxiety within this situation. With it is safe for you to love. Spirit is suggesting that you open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. But there's an interference mentally um, within the cycle. So this may be a cycle of interference that you you just want clarity. <laughs> yeah, could be dealing with uh, Capricorn. Or there's a lot of fear. There's a lot of being stuck. You, some some of us, and I say us because Virgo's my own, want clarity um, before we open up to a situation. So there's a separation right now from you and your partner. Um, nine of Wands. If not, if not a physical separation, there's an energetic separation. Three of Cups, there's a separation because there's a third party here. And there are some illusions. There's too many options, too many people in regards to the connection. Someone has found the strength to remove themselves from those illusions, to end that Ten of Cups. That's why there's a separation. That's why someone isn't aware if they should extend themselves out to a connection or not. So with retreat here, it says it's time to disconnect from the world. Someone may have retreated from you. You may have retreated from them. Retreated from an offer. Two of Pentacles, Queen of Swords. Someone is deciding not to be balanced, not to be juggled. Moving forward, Six of Swords. Um, honoring commitments toward their own foundation. Ten Pentacles. So someone ended something, ended some type of connection. Um, devil Energy and Ace of Cups. Could be dealing with a Capricorn or could be dealing with just letting the fear go and releasing the love. Someone retreated from a situation. This could be true love. This literally can be a true love situation, but someone retreated because they feel like it's just not enough. The love isn't enough, and that's the clear that's the answer. So someone, there's too much deception, there's too much um other stuff. Love is not enough. So some of you guys may be in a connection and someone, because this was third party, someone other than the person you're with is now single and is trying to find what they would like on the tangible because they feel like this connection, there wasn't enough um, attraction, enough chemistry, there wasn't enough to sustain a relationship, there was too much heartache. And someone didn't want to continue to hold on to sex and heartache. Other people involved in the situation someone wants to manifest true love the person that is retreating wants to manifest true love in their life why is true love here it says this is the romance of a lifetime why is true love here seven of swords hmm. Hmm. queen of wands someone's moved in a new direction holding on that so listen someone's independent but they're very guarded and very worried your true love 
for some of you guys is very guarded, very worried, maybe deceptive, or you may be deceptive. Somebody's deceptive, but they're very worried and guarded about this connection. They feel like it's not enough, like the love isn't enough. So they may be trying to escape what they, whatever um, is keeping them from being. Someone is trying to escape something that's keeping them from being single, single so they can go in a new direction. But someone is clearly single. So this is a third party. And the person that is not single um, is trying to escape or may be deceptive in offering themselves when they are not single. So let's see what guidance we have. What guidance do we have for Virgo? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What messages do we have for Virgo moving forward? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We've got past success through the power of love. You're, you release any stagnation any stagnant situations in order to transform your heart space y'all i am not tired but for some reason my words have not been i know why but you know when you're gonna we're just gonna keep moving forward so with commitment it says you dedicate yourself to beliefs wholeheartedly knowing that love is the essence of your very um being you guys may be wanting to detach from a commitment but you're not expressing that so you're really stuck in your past because you won't allow yourself to let go and that's the truth this is all i have peace y'all